Hi, this is Stephanie Miller from The Stephanie Miller Show. Please enjoy this exclusive clip from my show on Political Voices Network. Here, there's something to look forward to. Call to Activism says breaking Trump is poised to lose millions by using his mugshot to sell t-shirts if Fonnie Willis enforces Georgia's copyright. Various legal experts have noted Trump's sale of that mugshot taken by the Fulton County Sheriff likely violates U.S. copyright laws, which fantastically I could mean he could fund wondered, his own I prosecution. <laughs> I wondered about that. that. I wondered whether or not the Fulton County uh, Jail owned the rights to yes. the mugshot. Yes, I mean, whether they enforce it, I don't know, but it's hilarious that he could literally be funding his own prosecution. He could owe them huh. that money, which would just be <laughs> fantastic. <laughs> um, but you know, as, 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 as the legal processes are uh, beginning to pile up, uh, and, you know, the cries of witch hunt are becoming louder and louder from yeah. from Mar-a-Lago. Luckily, I have in my, my hand here mm-hmm. an English translation of the Malleus Malic- Maleficarum, the Hammer of the Witches. Uh-huh. So I can consult it uh, when uh, when people start yelling about witch hunts. There you go. Because <laughs> these are the rules for hunting witches. There you go. And I keep it handy because yes. you never can tell what Sam Alito will use as a source material. <laughs> right. Now. And will <laughs> someone say, but are you a good witch or a bad witch? Why I'm not a witch at all. Um, Mike tweets. Oh, you're up to you have no power here. <laughs> Thank you, Charlie. <laughs> Yeah, we just played it, uh, Marjorie Taylor Greene, but uh, Mike tweets, Marjorie Taylor Greene starts wild new conspiracy theory, says 75,000 Burning Man revelers were trapped in the mud to brainwash them into thinking climate change is real, and then they'll spread the word when they get out. Um, oh, and the left is behind all this. Um, we have that audio. Oh, you do you want to do that to Charlie? Okay, go yeah, ahead. Yeah, because, it, because, because she's even more incoherent than that. I yeah. mean, that's a... That's a cleaned up version of what you They're said. They're out of order for some reason. Yeah, and I by the way, shouldn't Alex Jones be out there working in a gas and sip and pay off the Sandy Hook parents by now? Yeah, yes. I would think so. Okay, here it is. I'm sorry to do there's it. Th- there's 73, 75,000 people in Nevada desert right now at this Burning Man. They're locked in. They're not allowed to leave. And they're basically probably being brainwashed that climate change is the cause of all of it. Well, the, 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 and it's going to destroy the earth. And they're they're feeling the panic. And the, the media is saying that. Oh, this yes. is because you didn't know about climate change. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> John Pavlovitz reminds us she will likely be part of the next presidential cabinet if good people, A, don't vote, vote third party, protest vote, support no labels. President Biden, the Democratic Party, are the only path to avoiding someone as evil and unstable as Marjorie Taylor Greene from power. Um, Charlie, do I... Do people not get how transparent, for instance, no labels is? There aren't they just saying this is about getting Trump back into office? We well, are I mean, Republicans. I, 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 can't, we are, I can't criticize uh, the national media I mean, if you don't know what a farce no labels is by now, yeah, you, you haven't been paying attention, and you deserve what you get. Well, let's start with there is a label. It's called Republican. <laughs> it's called yeah, far, yeah, it's far right Republican. Exactly, you're exactly right. I mean, you know who's involved in that? Charlie Flack, who used to be in business with Roger Stone and Paul Manafort. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. he's the third. Of, he's the third name in Manafort, uh, uh, Stone, Black and Stone, or Stone and Black, or whatever it was. Right, right. There's yeah, a yeah. picture of the three of them around the desk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Um, where were they? Hold, hold, please. Plus, I mean, you know, the na- anything the name, you know, I, I, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't take a, 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 you know, a million dollar check if I had the name Joe Lieberman on it anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Lieberman, douche. Um, <laughs> noted. <laughs> yes, yeah, so noted. Yeah, but he, he's a douche from another age. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, he's like, no, a, he's like a, I don't know, a, mid-cent- <laughs> a mid-last century douche. Right. Yes, exactly. By the way, Julie Brown stole that from us. Right. That was, yes, and it went into her song. Joe Lieberman, douche. Okay. Um, <laughs> but so noted, Charlie. You know, speaking, you are a student of history, as we know. This is just, when we talk about, you know, the mainstream media, Charlie, it's just there are so many subjects. One of them is Afghanistan that drives me insane, how they just, you know, report that like it's fat. Oh, it was just a disaster under Biden. And uh, 
as uh, Dr. Betsy tweets, the Trump administration in 2020 negotiated a withdrawal agreement with the Taliban that excluded the Afghan government, freed 5,000 imprisoned Taliban soldiers, and set a date certain of May 2021 for the final withdrawal. All Trump, not Biden. It's just, why is there never context reported that Trump bragged well, about, I mean, you can't it's, undo it's, this? It's, it's the same thing at work with, uh, you know, they're raising, railing about Biden and uh, lockdowns and mask, mask mandates. Yes, thank you. That was Trump. Yeah. It's the same thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, and it just, again, if you look at any graph, Charlie, you can't spin the jobs. Trump lost jobs. Biden gained more than any history president in the last 50 years, right? Yeah, I, 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 no, I, and I, what, I, what I'm really, starting, what I'm starting to get worried about, and God knows it wouldn't be a presidential cycle if I wasn't worried about something, uh, is the use of Kamala Harris as an excuse not to vote for Joe Biden. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. First of all, it's not even, it's not, it's not in any way attached to reality. Right. I mean, she's a, she's a perfectly adequate, if not good, vice president. Yep. And she could ascend to office tomorrow. And we'd be fine. Yeah. 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 It's they try there. I, I, I keep saying this, Charlie. Unfortunately, she's getting all of the racism Barack Obama, Obama got and the sexism Hillary Clinton got. And that's all it is. It's just little, little, little boogie boogie black lady. And I don't even want I don't even want to talk about the irony of Nikki Haley doing this. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I was saying, Charlie, you know, she this weekend, they just they're so weaselly. She asked about raising her hand, saying, yes, I'd vote for a convicted felon. And she's like, oh, well, the American people are smarter than that. You know, so, oh, the Ameri- you want the American people to save you from your horrible judgment. Is that what, yeah, you, you what can't, you're saying? Yeah, you can't say no, so, that she, so you're going to get the American people to say no for you. Right. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Charlie said... You have one, lady, you have one job. Right. You know? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you're a presidential candidate, and you're talking about one of the... the, the the primary obstacles in the way of your winning yeah exactly light him up i mean that's what you do yep exactly um charlie say goodbye to your lover jody Ah, uh, goodbye jody goodbye 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 charlie. raise the parting glass boost your immunity now with tapiro the new high potency great tasting elderberry gummies infused with zinc and vitamin c tapiro is available exclusively at healthpowerusa.com boost your immunity order your supply of tapiro now at healthpowerusa.com